Uh, this was a, uh, a really good final game for us, uh, taxing, making the trip, and all that kind of stuff, first chance on the road. Uh, we really tried to emphasize that to our guys just, just so that we could start the process because we play so many games on the road here coming up, and we got to know how to do it. Uh, and coming here is a special place, good crowd and all that kind of stuff, so we had to do silent count, all the things that you do on the road, uh, and, and it was our, our young guys handling it. Um, what I'm really pleased about and I, I love about these guys is they, it doesn't matter who's out there, they, they play their tails off, and, and we're, we're getting terrific effort up front on offense, uh, up, front, up front on defense from our guys, regardless of who's out there. And, and uh, we fight all the way throughout whatever the opportunity presents to us. Uh, and Holton's trying to bring him down and win the football game right there at the end. We all thinking we're going to win. And uh, the mentality of that uh, that is in this locker room is, uh, is special. It's, it's strong. It's uh, together. And I, I couldn't be more pleased with it. You know, as, we're, as we get to this weekend, <clears throat> you know, you think about, okay, the, the, here comes the, the change in the roster and all that. 69 of these players are going to be with us. And uh, that's a that's a bunch of guys in this locker room right here are going to stay with us. And, and uh, there will be some changes. There are always some. But there's the bulk of these guys are going to be with us. And I love that because these guys are connected. And, and it, they know how we play, what we expect, how we prepare, how, you know, the, how we talk about our challenges and all of that. And that's going to only make us better as we go through the, uh, the start of the season coming up. So um, I feel really good where we are right now. We've had a great camp. Yeah, I would love to get that touchdown right there, and I'd be screaming about you can win the game in the fourth quarter and all that kind of stuff and have fun with it. We didn't get that. But all the rest of it we did. And uh, so I'm really, really pleased with all the work that's being done here. He did pretty good. You know, he, he left his feet on a sack opportunity that he's kicking himself about. Uh, it's probably the first real shot Artie's had at one of those. So, um, you know, he's got to learn. But Artie did a really good job all camp. He's been really steady, uh, been really consistent for us, and very flexible in how we, where he plays and all of that. Uh, he, he helped us out there. He's done everything he's had a chance to do. He, he's, he's, he's blocked well. He's played with terrific effort. He's a smart kid. He's made big plays. He's made routine plays. He's just come through whatever we're asking him to do. And, and uh, just I'm thrilled for him that he had another chance in this game. And, and Drew gives him a great pass and a, and a great call. And the whole thing was just a gorgeous football play. And then he figured he figured out how to finish it just right. So he's been he's been terrific. Yeah, well, he, he has great hands, and he catches the heck out of the football all the time, and so there's nothing new there, but he came through. He still got to do it in the game, and uh, really glad that he got the opportunities to show it, and, and, and he put it on film. Is he okay? Or? Yeah, I don't, no problem that I know of. Did you just want to put all players in that situation? Like I wanted to play. Dad's here, you know, the whole thing. You know, I wanted to play. We, he's been he's been such a great competitor through, uh, throughout this camp, and I I didn't think he had any less chance of winning than, than anybody else in the game. And you saw it; he almost got it done. You know, he took us right down there, and we were we were in there, you know, plugging away for, for the win right there. And uh, so, he he's had a really good camp for us now, a terrific camp. On the, on the whole, what did Drew Lock show you? I, I thought Drew showed that he can get out there and play in all kinds of situations. He's comfortable with it. He handles it well. He communicates really well with the coaches and his teammates as, you know, as we face the challenges that come up you know, in the games and, and on the sidelines and in the locker room and all of that. Uh, he's, he's ready to play football. That, the whole idea here was to get him ready to play football uh, in this preseason, and I feel 100% solid that he's ready to go. And so now he has to prepare every every day like it's his day, and and uh, that's he's going to try to take a lesson from Gino about how to do that, and uh, um, I'm going to be on him hard about that because he knows exactly what it is to get that done, uh, and he needs to keep doing it week after week, and and when the time comes, he'll be ready to go. I, I, I think they've seen him. I mean, he's he can do everything. He can make all the throws. He can move. He can get out of the pocket when we need him to. Uh, he's handled all the checks and everything that we need to do. The, the really, there's, if he's in the game, we're, we're going to go win a football game. That's what we should be thinking. What did you think about Michael Jackson? Yeah, I, I need to see the film. I, I don't really have a good call on that. I'm sorry. Coach, what would you say has been special about this Packers team to ones that you've seen in the past? Um, I, you know, I haven't watched them very much, to tell you the truth. Uh, we, we just saw a little bit of film of them in, in weeks prep. Um, they're really well coached, and they're really sharp at what they do. They've got great mix in, in, their, in their offense. They've got a challenging scheme defensively. But I, I really I haven't looked at them that hard. I can't tell you.
Yeah, I thought he did all right. You know, they, they moved the ball a little bit. Uh, we, we didn't get off the field very well. Scrambled to make some first downs, and, and uh, they were really resourceful about moving the sticks. Um, so you know, I, I thought he looked like he was, he's in command. Looks like a good athlete out there. Please also side. Is it a good thing for your guys if they have your starters and their starters and these backups for you guys? Just that Heck yeah. Yeah, our guys knew exactly what was going on. Yeah, we knew exactly what was going on. Took on the challenge, and I thought it held up really well, both sides of the ball. Is Devin Bush okay? Uh, he, he got a concussion. He, he, he's, he looks like he was in a, in a boxing match. He got a little, little something over his eye there. And he's tough as hell. He said he, he'll be fine. Yeah, yeah. We, 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 I, I can understand growing up. I mean, think about it. This kid grew up all the time. And he was his first chance ever. And he, he, his, mind, his mind went wacko. And he, and he, you know, he does the whole, whole thing there. So, uh Kind of cracked me up, to tell you the truth. But it was a terrible, it was a terrible thought at that time. We just made a, a terrific play. <laughs> you know, but I can see where it came from. I mean, it might have been three or four years old the first time you saw that happen. You know. So. Is he okay or was he? I hurt his shoulder. Did hurt his shoulder. Yeah, he was active. He's doing well, real well. He had, unfortunately, he got banged up. I think he's been really effective. I, in every game, he's gone in. He's found ways to make big plays. Um, he, he's got good instincts. He's got good feel for the, for the line of scrimmage. He seems to get out the back door all the time on him and you know, on runs. Um, I love the way he hit the, the touchdown run down there. You know, to knock it in. Um, he's been a good player for us. Awesome that he got all that play time. You know, we weren't sure if he would be able to hold up. Uh, in there and uh, going in, he did a great job. This kid is a really tough kid. His mindset, his mentality about it is exactly what you're looking for. Uh, he easily could have said, you know, that, you know, I think I need to come out now or something. He, he was battling to stay in. So uh, that's a really good competitive uh, demonstration by him again, and a tough, tough demonstration by him again. You don't often point out the 69 players at the end of the season. This roster more I would love to keep this, this group. Yeah, I would love this group to be together. If we can, we're going to try to do that, and if we can, we'll see how it goes. You know, we'll, we'll have some challenges about that. But um, right now, there's a bunch of guys that know how they fit on, on this team, and what, you know, their role and all that kind of stuff. I like to keep it as solid as we can. It's probably not possible to get it all, but uh, I want those guys to know that we want them on a, in our locker room. Yeah, a little bit. I think a little bit. We're more aware. You know, Johnny and I are more aware of you know how many guys we're you know we're really managing to be on the squad and in the locker room with us. And and uh, this is a really good place. These guys have been part of it. I want to keep that going as best we can because we have a chance to have a really good club. Because we've been see you again for a few, few days. Anything more, Jackson? Uh, I'm sorry about that. I can't. Remember. If you want to give me a call or something, you know. <laughs> Um, uh, Feel free. I, I just, if there's any, if you got any additional work on, on Jackson? Yeah. Uh, he came back to the building and he was, he was playing with the football. He was, he was ready to, he was talking like he's okay and all that. His attitude was great. And uh, so where they might say, oh, it's going to be 10 days or something, you know, and he, he's not going for that now. He wants to get going and, and get running and all of that. So we'll see how that works out. Um, we're, he's the kind of kid we have to hold back probably more than anything. Um, I was really pleased about it. His, on, upon his departure, he was talking the same way. Whatever this is, I'm going to be okay. Don't worry about it kind of thing. And he came back even more forthright in that regard. So it was uh, really good. He, yeah, he has a little brace on. Is there a follow He hurt his shoulder a little bit. He, 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 he sprained his shoulder a little bit. Are any of those injuries from today something you I, I, Joey's shoulder and, and really D Hall's shoulder is really what we're talking about. The concussion, though, um, we just got to see what it is. We, we won't know until we get it looked at. But both of them, you know, get like AC sprains, kind of thing, that, that kind of situation. Talk about that. I mean, besides the word, obviously, come back. And do a lot. Are you is Jordan the hard track to be ready to play for us? Um, I'll be shocked if he's not playing. I'll be shocked because he, he just looks great. He's been running around. He's been practicing normal. He'll get all this week and all next week. I'll be shocked if he's not ready. But if he isn't, we're not going to play him. You know, if he's not ready to go and we're not confident that he's been able to show everything that he can do, and he feels that as well, we, we're not going to force that at all. But I, he just looks so good that I'll be surprised if he's not ready to go. We left him behind so that he kept a great weekend of work as well and all of that. So um, hopefully that will all add up for us.
Did Jamal get on the field yesterday? No, no, not yet. Not yet. We, we didn't have the right set of uh, practice. That's what we're shooting for. He, he's, he's at home too, trying to get a great weekend in to see if he can, uh, if he can show us that. I watched him run yesterday. Yesterday, I think it was, and he's flying, so he's going. Uh, but there's a lot more to it than that. You know, it's the conditioning level that he can maintain and hold up. Uh, you know, with the with the workload, with practices, and all. We got to figure that out. Uh, Wolves. It'll be to Tuesday before we get on the field with him. But he'll be work, He's working out with our guys all weekend. Okay.